100 years from now, we will be in the year 2123. Every single person listening to this will likely be underground. Our bodies will become part of the soil. During that time, our final destination would have been known to us. Meanwhile, our houses that we left behind would have become home for strangers. Our jobs would be done by others. And as for us, hardly will anyone mention us again. We will be forgotten. When was the last time you remembered your great-grandfather? How often does your great-grandmother cross your mind? Our presence on earth today, the presence that we make so much noise about and share so many tears for, was preceded by countless generations before us and shall be followed by countless generations after us. Every generation that passes through this earth barely finds the time to take a glance at the world before leaving it. And having not fulfilled even a fraction of one's ambitions, our lives are in reality far shorter than we can even imagine. In 2123, every one of us will realize from within the grave just how worthless this world actually was and how trivial were those dreams centered on it. In 2123, every one of us will be wishing that we had dedicated our life to serve humanity and had devoted ourselves to collection of as many good deeds and memories as possible, particularly those good deeds that continue to benefit society after our death. In 2123, many of us listening to this will be screaming in pain and will wish to have another opportunity to come back to do good to humanity and the possibility of that will be zero. In 2123, many of us will be biting our hands and wishing we had given more to humanity and created good memories than we are doing now. Guys, we all know this day is coming and the wise individual will listen and do the right thing in order to have less regrets when we finally watch another generation take over this planet from our graves. Death, there's no wait for us to be prepared. Let us prepare and wait for death. Let us leave this earth better than we met it and the next generation will be super grateful and proud of us. I'm sadly saying this. Just think about it.